Okay, sports fans, it's Matthew. I'm back and I'm sharing this multi function copier I just bought. It's a laser. Um, I've shot a few videos, they're in the description below if you'd like to check them out. There's also a link to check this out for yourself on Amazon. It's the Brother MFC 9330 CDW. It does full duplex printing, it does not do full duplex scanning, but I'm going to demonstrate the scanner to you right now. So it took me a little while to figure it out. I had installed the application on my desktop here, or my, my computer here, but I was a little confused as to where it was at. I kept searching in the brother menu, nothing was coming up. So I went down to here, this is a Nuance Paper Port. That's the actual scanning application. Um, I think it was called Paper Port right there. Click that. It's gonna load it up. I'm gonna be honest, I never use these. I scan in my own software, so I actually scan. I have Adobe Acrobat Pro. I'm a real estate agent and uh, I can't live without this. I scan in here, um, but this is the application that came with it, so I'm going to demonstrate that to you and uh, demonstrate the scanner. Uh, here is what I'm going to scan, it's a buyer booklet I made. I, I don't really need to scan it, but uh, I'll put it on there. You just set it up here on the tray. Uh, I don't think you saw that. Let me do it again. I'll take it off, put it back on. It says your document's ready. It says auto document feed ready. You can see it on the top there. Uh, this doesn't do full, full duplex scanning. I think I mentioned that. It only does single sided. And when I click this, it, I guess you can change your scan settings here. Oh, here we go. We can go color, gray, squill, back in, black and white, all that stuff. But I'm going to, uh, I think you can get even finer set here. This thing will scan to infinity. We can go all the way up to 2400 DPI. You can do 300. That's pretty good for uh, the legal documents and contracts. I sign, or I work with, I'm going to click scan and we're gonna to go to the scanner. It started its process, and you'll see here, I scanned something before, it works really well. It uh, grabs it, it doesn't seem to be double feeding, which is a, a big problem with some of these. The only thing I notice is, since this is a little short up here, it wants to push the papers over the side, so you may wanna watch while you're scanning. Um, I had thought about butting this up against the wall, but you can't do that because there's a, a vent fan down in the corner you do not want to um, plug up. While it's doing that, I'm gonna demonstrate, this is gonna save me an unbelievable amount of time because before I scanned a lot of contracts, I was using a flatbed scanner with, like this without an auto document feeder and I'd have to scan one page, then go back to my computer, switch the page, go back and forth and back and forth for hundreds of pages. I did have a bubble jet for a while that had an auto document feeder, but I think you heard me say one of its problems was it's really low quality, despite it costs almost as much as this multi-function copier, it's, uh, it would double feed all the time. It was horrible to work with, and it was very expensive printer, in excess of $300. Partly I bought it because I'm into photography and I wanted to do my own prints, but I was so disappointed, $300, I made about five prints and it wouldn't work anymore. Ink was dry, I tried, uh, I tried a continuous ink system with it and that didn't work. I got a new one through warranty, that didn't work. I got two or three more inkjet printers, those didn't work, different brands. I rebuilt print heads, I rebuilt my own cartridges, I bought new cartridges, you name it, I tried it with inkjet, I'm through with it. I bought this multi-function laser jet copier from uh, Brother, and I am happy to be, I'm like a kid on Christmas day, very excited to have it. It's gonna save me so much time and grief. It looks like it's scanned. I did this wirelessly. It just sent it over here. I can scan. Uh, if you want to scan two-sided, that's uh, very nice. It has a button there to scan the other side. You simply take these off and put them right back on top here and scans the other side. So, um, yeah, you do have to come back once to scan the other side if you want to do double-sided. 
but um, I think that's pretty darn convenient. Uh, you can scan another set of pages there, on, on, on. I'm just gonna click done. I was extremely satisfied with the quality that came out in my previous test. It's taken a little while, it's bringing it across or processing it into a PDF, I suppose. Um, while we're here, you do have a number of uh, output selections you can do. Uh, it's still processing. You can also uh, lift this up if you want to scan photos or a book or whatever. This raises, so you can still close it just like a copier. And I, I'm quite thrilled. It looks like it will go. It'll go to a pretty decent size. This is a, a this is a letter-sized paper. I guess it goes a little bit bigger than that. Not too much. Um, but for your everyday office needs, I think this is just phenomenal. I'm, I'm doing a series of videos to demonstrate it. If you have any questions about it, make sure to ask those in the comments below. Uh, again, there's links you can buy it from the description below. I appreciate that because I do get a few dollars if you do that. Um, one thing you'll want to do is click those links and um, see for yourself, the reviews are quite good for this printer. It was one of the top reviewed printers on Amazon. And it was also one of the, you know, not the cheapest, but it was quite reasonable. Um, the scan quality here is phenomenal. Um, my other printers, my bubble jet printers, despite how expensive of one I would buy. They always kind of came out with a ho-hum scan that was a little fuzzy. It looks like it had a lot of noise. I could bump up the DPI. I could, you know, do the finest quality scan where it'd take forever. And I just couldn't get past that. So I hardly spent more. You, If you get the single-sided print version of this, the non-full duplex print, it's the same printer, only prints on one side of the paper, um, it is the same price as some of these bubble jet printers I've bought. So keep that in mind. Buy this printer. That's the only advice I can give you. Don't monkey around with the bubble jets. Get that guy. I'm going to do some durability videos here if you're a little concerned how well it lasts. Um, but the, the quality of the scan, and it's on one of the lowest scan settings, is amazing. It looks like this was almost, this looks like it's almost in, in Word documents, there's no noise, there's no, um, I don't know, no ghosting around the scan itself. It is just, this This is unbelievable. I, I love this guy already. I highly recommend him. I'm 100% satisfied so far. I'll continue to shoot some demonstration videos as I do more and more at the printer. Um, Again, if you have any questions, I'd be happy to demonstrate or answer them. Ask those in the comments below. Uh, if you'd like to get this, I don't think you'd be disappointed. The only thing I haven't got experience with is testing how long these cartridges last for. But I am going to uh, try and reload them. I'll demonstrate it when the time comes. And um, uh, yeah, so you can buy the printer from the links below. Um, in the description. Thanks a lot. Again, my name's Matthew, and I hope you enjoy your new printer.